the final product. Look at the egg rolls. So beautiful. This is the best egg rolls I have ever made. I make three, I believe three videos on how to make egg rolls. But this one is the best one. I got all the ingredients right. So follow me. Follow me on this journey of making the most tasty, tasty video. Hello and welcome to the Taste Show with Crystal. In this video, I'm going to show you how I make egg rolls. For egg rolls, we have ground pork, shrimp, vermicelli, carrots, spring onion, ikama, ikama, I shredded already. And I have taro, taro and ikama. And of course, egg roll, you need one egg to bind it all together. So um, this is already done. Let me go ahead and do the carrot. With this vermicelli, what I did was I soaked it in warm, in cold water for 10 minutes and then I let it drain out all the water and then now I'm going to go ahead and cut it about um, 2 inches long, 1 inch to 2 inches long. My spring onion right here. Go ahead and cut into small pieces. So this is my ground pork right here. I'm gonna go ahead and season it down. This is salt. This is ground pepper. This is um, Panda brand oyster flavor sauce. You crack my egg. So 
So after I put seasoning in, go ahead and uh, rub it. Mix it all together. the vegetables that I cut them, I'll go ahead and add them. I go ahead and um, season in this vegetable. I'll go ahead and put the meat in. So these are the um, large shrimp that I bought. They are already deveined. So I do all I do is just um, wash it up with um, cold water or warm water, and then uh, soak it in one with one one tablespoon of salt, so we can take out the um, fishy smell from the shrimp. Uh, after that, I cut them into halves. Two pounds of shrimp. And I will go ahead and season it. One tablespoon of oyster sauce. And half. 
half a tablespoon of uh, salt and pepper half a tablespoon of pepper and half a tablespoon of this is sesame oil I season the meat and the veggie separately from the shrimp. I will put in the description of everything I season in here. And now it is time to roll the egg rolls. All right, it is time to roll egg rolls. It took me about two hours for preparation for 100 egg rolls. It is hard work. So right here I have tea, um, the brand name, name is Spring Home, Spring Home TYJ Spring Roll Pastry. I really like this brand. I bought two packs, 50 per pack. To seal the egg roll, I use one egg, but I only use the white and and not use the the yolk. So this is the white egg. One piece of shrimp. This is half of a shrimp. It took me three hours to prepare and make 50 egg rolls. This is 10 of the 50 egg rolls I made. So tired. So I'm gonna make the rest of the egg rolls tomorrow. I need a break right now. I, uh, right now I'm gonna go ahead and fry the egg roll with veg vegetable oil. So these are the bags that I put in. I bought the Ziploc bag, but it's for freezer. So let me show you what it looks like. 
freezer and storage bags and this one is uh, 15 bags at 8 inch by 7 8 inch by 7 very very good um, each bag I were able to add, to put seven egg rolls one two three four five six and seven and uh, the last this is one on the top and six on the bottom and I lay it on on the, on the freeze inside the freezer just flat like this you can also to put one on top of another and um, freeze them and then uh, before you eat just take it out do not defrost them when you fry the egg roll the egg roll has to be frozen so it can be crunchy do not defrost before you fry just fry it uh, or boil the hot vegetable oil and then just deep fry it and if you want it crunchy egg rolls you can deep fry it one time take it out and then put it back one more time then the egg roll will get really crunchy and uh, tasty so let me test this oil to see if it's ready or not I'm putting one the reason I'm making making 100 egg rolls this time is for uh, the Lunar New Year Lunar New Year is on Friday coming up and I'm giving away I'm giving away 20 about 50 60 about 50 egg rolls I'm giving away that's why I'm making so many How, how beautiful they look. Golden brown. This is the um, fourth time I believe, three or four times that I make egg rolls. And I share it on uh, YouTube, on my other channel. And um, you know, the more you make egg rolls, the more you have experience what to put in there and what not to put in there. So um, this time, I'm very happy and satisfied with the outcome so far because my egg rolls are not broken at all, all in one piece. I just can't wait to taste it. <laughs> Think it's ready. What I did is I fried this the second one time. First time I took it out and then I put it back in the second time. It get very brown. Wow. This is the moment of truth. <laughs> Over three hours of hard work. Let's see how this goes. So what I did is I made 50 egg rolls total and I have 50 more to go tomorrow. I'll try first one. This is so delicious. I don't think you can find this kind of egg roll anywhere because the quality I put in here way too expensive to sell out there mm. 
the taro tastes so good and the shrimp the flavor is just, just so so good so this is my three to four times of making tutorial how to make egg rolls and this is I'm very very satisfied with this time my egg rolls are fully when I fry after I fry them no broken and the flavor is just just so so tasty so um, I will list all the ingredients I have in the description for this video I hope you enjoy what I have shown you how to make Vietnamese egg rolls very just not just Vietnamese but an extra cake because Vietnamese egg roll they don't put shrimp and if you love shrimp then use the shrimp add it to it it just give a, a very taste a very good flavor and uh, if you decide to make this recipe don't forget to uh, tag me um, put on a case comment that you make it thank you thank you for watching the video I'm very grateful for my first video on this channel taste show with crystal and um, I'm working on making at least one video a week to show you um, what I do with my uh, cooking channel <laughs> Thank you. Take care and see you next on my next cooking video. Bye bye.